Flash flooding made the morning commute dangerous for drivers in southwest Arkansas. NBC 6's Brittany DeFran joins me in studio now sharing more details. It's our top story tonight. Brittany? That's right, Dan. People just trying to go about their day and not realizing the severity of how much rain had fallen. It came so fast, I didn't know what to do. The community of Stamps relies on Freddie Solomon to deliver their mail, but today his route had an unexpected turn of events. I saw the flooded water, I stopped and was going to back up. When I stopped, the water came and swept the truck over into the ditch. But Solomon's quick thinking saved his life. One minute you're driving, next minute you're fighting for your life. We feel like he followed all safety precautions. It was an act of God that he is alive. The site and impact of flooded waters is a first for Brewer. Transportation officials say they haven't seen such a thing in more than 50 years. I have seen it to where the pond was flooded pretty good over here, but uh, not this not this bad. Roads uh, have buckled, culverts pushed out of the ground. We have a pond here in town that's flooded over a highway. As they work to restore power for residents, others are simply thankful to be alive. Just thank the man upstairs that it, it, it wasn't my time to go yet. And along with working to restore power, City Public's work began their morning barricading roads and clearing fallen trees off roadways.